The New York Times reports that the curse of the Ferals is being blamed for causing the week-long cargo ship clog up on the Suez Canal and other unfortunate events in Egypt as the country prepares to move ancient mummies for a parade. According to the article in the New York Post, the Ferals curse is the age-old myth that anyone who disturbs the mummy of an ancient Egyptian Feral will face bad luck and even death. Death will come on quick wings for those who disturb the king's peace, says the warning on King Tut's tomb. Some of the superstitious believe the curse was recently triggered by preparations for the April the 3rd Pharaoh's Golden Parade, according to a report for Arab News. Officials have been preparing to transfer 22 mummies of ancient kings and queens to a new museum in the wake of the tragedy and perhaps just bad luck in Egypt with the Suez Canal conundrum and also a fatal train crash that killed dozens and a building collapse in Cairo that left 18 dead. Shops in Zagazig were also recently destroyed in a fire and a bridge that was being built in Mariotta collapsed. Pleas on Facebook to not move the mummies had people begging and exclaiming please do not move the mummies from this place beware of the wrath of the ferals twitter was alight with the hashtag keep the mummies where they are with one user saying i have a feeling that the catastrophes happening in egypt have been happening because of the movement on the 3rd of april but zahi hawass a prominent egyptologist says the curse is just a load of baloney Hawass, who worked for National Geographic as its explorer-in-residence, celebrated the upcoming parade as a positive one calling it the biggest promotion for Egypt. The Evergreen, the 200,000 tonne mammoth vessel, was wedged in the narrow Suez Canal for six days before a fleet of tugboats were able to free it on Monday as billions of pounds of trade deployment sat in limbo. Ali's tragedies the curse of the pharaoh or just bad luck? What are we thinking here?